Sims is my first computer game. It's a different experience to, to doing film. Film tends to be, it's a lot more narrative based, but Sims has no narrative whatsoever because the gamers make up their own story. On that level, it's been quite a big learning curve. Elan uh, has uh, done a brilliant job. Uh, his work uh, on his films was so captivating uh, that we wanted to bring that to the game. People relate to music emotionally. We're very in tune with exactly how specific music makes us feel. I'm trying to just pinpoint a, a feeling. That, in a sense, is the same as when I write for anything else. It's all about what's this feeling, you know? It's like flirt fail is a sting that I've got to, got to go with. And so it's like I've got to imagine what does it feel like to just kind of embarrassingly fail at flirting? In fact, I don't need that much imagination. But, um... Yeah, 13 needs to be one beat shorter. We need a gap before. Yeah. 14, so, so just put a, a, a rest at the end of the bar. There is one thing that we're doing on The Sims 4 which is quite, which is quite unusual and I've never done anything like it before. In the areas of Sims where you're building a person, you're building a house, there's these long pieces of music and um, they need to have different levels. Depending what happens, you fade in from one to the other. It will go from being a, a sort of full production to just being a string trio and a piano and an acoustic guitar. And all these different intensities of music run at the same time. And, uh, and that's been really fun to, to write these pieces of music and then deconstruct them and, and, and say, all right, I'm going to do a string trio version of this and see what that sounds like. And that's come out really well and I've really enjoyed that process. Music for computer games has come a long way. Now it's kind of vital and, and core to translating the emotion. You know, you bring in things, orchestras and synthesizers and, and worlds and combine them and make it very, very, very interesting for us all. It's been quite difficult trying to find the, the exact style and I've worked a lot with, with Robbie trying to pinpoint it. There is one style of music, but its influences are from all over the place. And, um, and, and I feel like somehow that reflects contemporary culture. Today is a pretty major day for us because we're recording the theme song for The Sims 4 with a full orchestra here at Abbey Road. And the fact that we can do something so modern and forward thinking um, in such a historical setting, it's a really cool thing.